Welcome back everybody, Rasputin Gaming presents. This is our double plat trophy playthrough for Wolfenstein, the new order. And in this episode, we're going to grind out the two difficulty trophies, uh, the Uber trophy and the one for Death Incarnate. And uh, what you need to do after you complete it, just like we have in the other videos, is come here to chapters. Pick the last chapter, 16. Under the Fergus timeline, you want to stay there. Switch it to the Uber difficulty. And let's get rolling with it. So you know all this scene and how it, how it plays out. None of this changes here in the beginning. And the playthrough is very similar to our last playthrough for the beginning portions of this uh, video. I don't know how this guy's alive. He took three bullets right in the heart, it looks like. So everybody in this game seems to be a bullet sponge. to Death Head's compound here. Don't forget to friend and follow us on Twitch. Much appreciated if you do. If you're on YouTube, go ahead, like the video. I'll show you how to get through Uber difficulty on this and grab the trophies. And this is all about what could be. Also subscribe to the channel if you're on YouTube. Much appreciated. It doesn't cost you anything. It helps me out. We're right around the 50 subscriber mark. True. It's good. Alright, done daydreaming. It's time. From what we know of Death's Head's compound, prisoners are kept on the lower levels, close to the experimental labs. Uh, our timing needs to be perfect. We have the nuclear decryption keys now. You come in deep, surface real close to the compound. You fucking pulverize the outer wall with the cannon. Get inside the compound as fast as you can. They'll be returning fire, so we'll need to dive again before the U-boat gets gubbed up, after which we'll pull back to a safe distance. When you're inside, get down to the lower levels. Free the prisoners. We send in his helicopter. Once everyone is safely in the air, we prime the nuclear warheads, fire the atomic bombs, level the whole site. A bit more battle. No more death's head. Be so much easier if the woman in the Iron Man suit would take care of business for us. But then it wouldn't be much of a game, would it? And she's damn near invincible in that Don't super suit. Your magnificent cunt. Make sauce. All righty, righty. Let's get with it. We know all this part. We've done it before. Step in. Let the water come for us. Ah, we're drowning! Well, not really. Just have to wait for the doors to open. Careful. As you make your way to the cannon there, you're heading in okay. fast, and the currents are bound to be strong. Have to go sit on the, the gun here. Let the cinematic play out. Right, the Shoot that. Super ball out there. Opening up the compound for us. Death Head's compound. Fifty meters. 
this is all done for you nothing to do but sit there and let this play through and I'll discuss a couple of strategies as we go about the playthrough. Obviously we're not under uh, time constraints, so I'll try to do the best we can, uh, taking our time, being strategic in which enemies we fight and which ones we bypass. already so actually I could dive under the water. Just swim for the ladder right there in front of us. Well let's start with the shotgun. The shotgun. It really bugs me how that that uh, Never lines up quite right. Let's grab all the loot just like we did the first time through here. All the ammunition, the armor. Max on the armor, that's a 100 piece. That was pretty awesome just to start with. Some rockets, those are awesome. Big help for us, especially in this playthrough. I mean, we need a bunch at the end. Um, but you get a few of those out of the, the cartons and containers. So we will be using some here. But we'll try to spend a lot of the time bypassing some of the problematic uh, areas on Uber. Difficulty, some of these... Uh, hard to defeat large groups of enemies. I'm in your house, General. Is this the day? So that's where the gold armor collectible is. Alright, so the doggy should be coming as soon as we come through here and turn the corner, so be ready for him. Easy peasy. Down he goes. Armor's maxed out. Make sure we had grenades at one point. There's the auto save for the checkpoint. We're gonna just try and do this with what we have by um, running through. The biggest thing is to get engaged with the robot at the end. Oh my god, can't believe it. <laughs> Alright, so we have to make sure that we have that ready to go and um, on the right um, firing style, if you, if you will. Um, There we 
it goes. Switch back out of that. Oh, MG. And you can see he took out almost all of our armor. Or all of our... He actually did take out all of our armor. the headshots so it's not quite getting red for us here well there it was for a moment you can see our health is way down side now. Right in front of us. Let's run by that dude. There you go. Made it to the next checkpoint. Cutting mode. Made the, the hole a little small last time, <laughs> as you guys can see. But now we're in here, and you remember last time we went to the right, this time we're going to the left. Doesn't really matter. Kind of want to have both uh, options open to you. They're aware we're here now, so it's um, a little bit of an issue. So, uh, this right here is a charging station right outside there. I don't see either one of the super soldiers, but there are two in here. Anyways, guess can't I don't, Uber. You really shouldn't try and go toe to toe with him. I thought if we were fast enough with the laser, we could mow through him, but that didn't work. But 
you can see we're past the robot, so. Um, there actually is no way to shortcut this one like we just did the last one. Uh, let me power up here. charge for us. Let's switch back. Probably should have this in rocket mode. We're going to need quite a bit of rockets later on, but with these super soldiers, it's just something we have to take on. through the cover as well so we were covered there for a little bit we're just gonna try and pick and choose I'm letting this thing charge up some more so we're gonna go around the other way So it seems like I gotta line it up a little left of center. I always like to stay crouched down just in case the game is set up so that they can hear you move around. I don't know that for sure, uh, but this is kind of how I go about uber difficulty. Super soldiers are a problem. I wasn't sure I could throw a grenade through the through that little opening. That's why I didn't. Um, maybe next time we'll just cut it bigger and try and bounce a grenade through there. But this is the most difficult spot. We can kind of bat, well, second most difficult spot. We can bypass the spot that's supposed to be extremely difficult. Um, with a little bit of luck, we can do that. while we can.
never tell what's big enough and what's not quite big enough to get through. These guys are coming around, we have to go to the other side. It's like, boy, that's a, some funky cutting. as they come through first. Shotgun at close range you can see is good for kill. Super soldier. Optus for 10. We'll get all that back. So it's just working on those lightweight guys first and then trying to deal with the super soldiers. So it's really just a matter of hit and run, hit and running, hitting and running, hit and run, style of strategy to get this guy. Most of the lightweight guys. Switch to rockets here. I had already done enough damage to him, that was pretty awesome. I wasted one rocket though. I don't know if sending a second one just to be sure was wasting or not. Um, but nonetheless, that's what we have done. Let's see if there's any more guys over here. Juggernaut. Everybody except man, that's a jaggedy ass cut over there, isn't it? What the hell? It'd be nice if we could get to that side, but if there's somebody on the turret, they're gonna smoke me like nobody's business, and I hate to lose the pretty the awesome progress we made already. 
but the turret's easier to get from the other side. Oh, and there's one more super soldier dude. I saw him. Hopefully you guys did too. Probably could have popped him in the back from where we were, but... Let me get the lay of the land first. So we got him with three shots, three hits. Not sure if that's enough. We can see the key to Uber is just being patient, using what the game gives you in the way of uh, territory and landscape. So that's what we're doing. Like using the laser because it's, it auto refills. Okay, nobody on the turret. by the time we get to the other side. And then once we open the door, it'll um, save a new checkpoint, which is what we'll need. The developers Wolfenstein did great, I think, with the amount of checkpoints and where they're located. See a guy coming down the stairs. Oh, got hit. So they did make it possible, it's not, I mean, even though this is uber difficulty, this is not like uh, New Colossus, where the hardest difficulty was damn near impossible. The courtroom scene on uber difficulty was really just ridiculous, if you ask me. So now he's not really in a good spot to get. Let's switch to the marks. Not really going to be using this later on. So it's fine to use all what we got 58 shots left with it. This is going back and forth stuff, maybe uh, isn't your cup of tea, but this is how you get there. You can't slug it out with these guys on this difficulty. I don't know where he's standing now. made so much progress I'm not in favor of going out there and losing it all by having him smoke us like it's nobody's business. Get our weapon with the recharge. Well ammunition ready again. Let's see where this donkey is. You can see if I had that side open right then we could just go back and forth and be well right in the doorway. So with the strategy we're gonna do here, which is the try to avoid everybody strategy, we aren't going to use um, 
these weapons. If the strategy doesn't work, then you'd want to use one of these. Um, you want to park your ass in front of this door right here and just shoot them as they come through the walkway over there and then recharge and come back and shoot them. Um, that's how I've done it before. I want to try the sprint methodology out on you guys. See if that works. We're going to face a juggernaut, so we're going to need this. Pop the butt. Grab the armor. We're overcharged, but it's close to max. So you want to run down the left side. So that's what we're going to try. There's going to be one juggernaut in the way. So let's see if, if we can take him out. Oh, I just turned down the wrong damn door. Shit. Sorry about that. This is where you want to go. Yeah, we fucked that up. <laughs> Sorry about that. We went down the wrong door, so they were ready for us. You have to be fast in, in, to try and do this and hope that you can smoke him with the with your laser that you have enough. I mean, there should be enough firepower. I was trying to just destroy him with headshots. Um, but body shots can work as well. So let's try this again. Grab some armor because we're not at 100%. Uh. Okay, maybe the laser isn't enough by on its own. Would have thought it would be. It does so much damage. New strategy. Well, same strategy, different weapon, actually. So let's try it again. Try shotguns. didn't work either. Her frustrating. And we were holding down both triggers, firing like a mofo. With max health and damn near max armor, we couldn't get him down. It's unfortunate. Not giving up though. There we go. Oh. Didn't work, you can see that they were already blocking the way. So we're going to go back to the other strategy. I'm just not fast enough to get through there. Maybe you guys are. Um, but it takes too long to kill that guy. And for some reason, I'm not real good at the sprint. When I got to sprint down, I bump into walls and things, which automatically turns your sprinting off. So...
was trying to see if there was a left-handed. left-handed uh, holding of this so I could stand against the other door the other door the other side of the door Supposed to be coming through the door. You just got to play cat and mouse with them here. It's really all you can do. It's the only way always to keep them in front of you. If you go into that hallway where we ran where the juggernaut is, they can come at you from two directions, which is no bueno on uber difficulty. But right here, we can keep them in front of us. The amount of destructible walls here too, it's, it's tough. I need them to come at us, I'm not sure why they haven't yet. Gotta be ready to shoot if somebody pops through the door, but then you want to get up on the door again. See, I didn't have the best angle last time. He was almost able to walk out of my um, area of fire. But it should bring guys, and we should be just filling this hallway with bodies. not a fan of having them um, jump me as soon as I step in the hallway so I'm not in, really want to go in there. But there should be tons more guys coming. Oh, got us for darn near 30 points of armor right there. So I haven't seen the big robot dude come through the door. He's problematic. He's a big target, but he hits hard. So that's kind of an issue with him. Considering we don't really have cover, I can't utilize cover, you can see we can't use utilize cover with the with this laser machine gun. You can with the other weapons, but that means you're a little less powerful. See that's what I was talking about. You step out in the hall and all of a sudden they're there. Gone now. 
gives you a little bit of the time. You can see the armor dropping off. There he goes. Charged. Be ready for the next wave. Careful because we're out of armor. And health comes back, but can take more a 20 spot. It hurts. There's a lot more guys we're nowhere near done. Power level on this laser machine gun. We're three quarters to one. Feel I'm still okay. I don't hear anybody, so we'll charge up some more. when they yell that means there's a couple that come through the door. Damn. He hit us for 40 points, bastard. They do a lot of damage, you can see. If we wanted to drop, drop the machine gun, we could go over there and right here where I'm pointing. That's a uh, 80 or 100 health boost right there. And there's all kinds of armor on the ground. There he is. Big piece of shit. We could try and go in there and shoot him from there. But then he wind up being a long ways away, and then he uses rockets, which is kind of unfair. Okay, now he's not able to hit us. We can hit him. Excellent for us. Recharge. done this on Uber before, man. Sometimes when I'm charging, there'll be like three guys rushing through the door. Makes it an issue. Lots of armor and shit in the hallway. All of it's risky to get. some armor, but it wasn't enough. Headshots count. Get a little bit dicey if we're going to make this or not. A little bit dicey.
I'd like to get the health, but then we're in a bad spot down there at the end of the hall. Statues for cover. And prompt the guys to come through the door. Not this door, the one over there where I'm aiming. way you can try and do this this is the way that works for me is you can use the marksman rifle and sit in this cubby hole right here and try and pick them off before they get through the door but there's not a lot of ammo for that so if you're not good at getting headshots um, you know with the headshots they die in one shot you usually have enough ammo to get like 50 of them or so um, juggernauts take a couple super soldier and robot take a bunch so it gets a little bit more difficult. I just keep moving in the hall trying to trigger them. Sounds like they're out there. After all, this is uber difficulty, and we just need to try and be patient and punk these guys. any indication that we're in the clear yet. There's no hollering over the loudspeaker that you get sometimes when you've finished an area. Again, it's just about being patient. Difficulty survival is the key. See how much damage we only been hit a couple of times and almost shaved off every last ounce of our health. And this other strategy that I'm doing right now, pulling into the hallway, works better if you're a better shot than I am. I'm not too bad of a one. Let's see, I missed this guy. Told you, sometimes you're going to turn around, they're going to be right there in the doorway. Now, 
Yeah, so they're basically 40 hit points. 40 points of health left. Just not confident. even if the juggernauts we killed was the one in the hallway over there or not see I blew up a bunch of my cover on the left already Usually where there's one, there's more than one. Kind of like where there's smoke, there's fire. And I'll say it again, patience is the key. Uh, if you're following along with this, all you can really do, my estimation to get through this reasonably. And if you like what I'm showing you, you're getting some value out of this. Go ahead, like the video, subscribe on YouTube, much appreciated. Friend and follow us on Twitch if you want to get with me live. Although I'm not going to be uh, communicating a bunch with chat when we're doing things on Uber difficulty. Make sure we're aimed in the right spot. certain of what we're doing. Wow. It's been a little bit, so I'm feeling a little bold about going through here, coming out here. But I'm still scared. I only got 40 health. We're all scared. If I get too close in here, we're toast for sure. If there's anybody left. an eye above. Some more health, awesome. Here we go. I think there's some at the other end of the hallway too. We might be clear now how far we've gotten and nobody's attacked us. go is actually down a level, down those stairs. Some more armor. Looks like we're in the clear. And some more health. Get near max. And I think we might have done it guys.
That's the way I've always done it before, so I know it can be done. Some more rockets. Good for later on. Need to go over this little rise right here. Nobody shooting at us. Good to go. So really nothing else to do here. Except head to the next point. section I'm going Darf to ich ihn für dich aufschneiden? Yeah. in this video. <laughs> this woman is my life, you understand? My everything. Homeblatt. Oh, oh, baby! Kill Booby. There you go. Nothing to do about her. And back up we go. Gotta release the prisoners. So before this next section, right here we get the elevator. There should be a section for us. So right here, you can see we need to boost that guy up to free these guys. So let me pause it right here. Um, and then I'm going to end the video right here. Don't forget to friend and follow us on Twitch. And then we'll resume and do the last half with the boss fight in the next video. If you're on YouTube, go ahead and like the video, subscribe to the channel. Much appreciated. Be safe out there, and we will catch you next time.